Okay, so now we jump into the next video. So as far as a long-term correction going from, and this is assuming that we're in a long-term uh, bull market, and I mean like a very long-term, like 16, 24 year. Assuming that, that would mean that our target would be just about around this 10,000 level on the Dow Jones, or slightly above that somewhere in this area right here of this correction but now here that is the best case scenario now the worst case actually we'll go with the second scenario which is we would say okay this entire movement from here and here this was only three waves and then this right here was part of a correction. As you see, well, first off, we could do some quick measurements. So from here, it went from 11,300 to about 9,000. So it was about a 1,300 point correction over on this end. It would do that. Over on this end, the top was about 12,850. The bottom was around 10,500. So we're talking a 1,000 point correction here and then we're talking a 2,000 point correction here. So if you went from that viewpoint, you would say, okay, so that would mean that this correction is not proportional. So what we could do then, we would say, okay, if this entire area right here is only three waves, and from, an, from this viewpoint in a weekly chart, it really only looks like three waves. See, one, two, three. And if this is only three waves, where it kind of looks like it too, one, two, three, that would mean that this entire thing right here is an expanded flat pattern, which I will write that down in slightly larger font. Expanded flat, and that's another Elliott wave uh, terminology. And the idea from that, what we can gather, is that this is the second worst case, I mean, second best case scenario. That would mean that we had three waves down here, three waves up right here, and that means that we're going to project our target, which is going to be, let's see, we go from the top of here to about the bottom of here, or if we go in reverse, from the bottom of here to the top of here. And the idea is it's going to be a five wave correction, so we expect it to be extended, which gives us price targets of about 9,700, 9, and if bad things really do happen, 7,500 on the Dow. Okay, so that is the second best case scenario. Check out the next video for the second worst case scenario, if we look at it from a long-term perspective.